So there I was minding my business, thinking that I was gonna drop my project power review and everything's gonna be all right and I can just go to bed only for one of the biggest stories to come out in the anime community. Wow. Hey everyone, how you doing today? And welcome back to The Culture. Now, this is the show where I talk about the latest and greatest in pop culture, and I give you my thoughts and impressions of them. So if you like anime, movies, or video games, subscribe to this channel because I talk about that a lot. And also like this video if you like stuff like this. Also, click the notification bell so you can have a piece of me on your timeline every time you open YouTube. So anyway, let's get to the main story at hand. So Kiss Anime. If you watch anime, you know what Kiss Anime is. Let's be real here. Let's not lie. Even if you're a Crunchyroll or Funimation subscriber, you, you know what Kiss Anime is. So Kiss Anime, the biggest illegal site for watching anime has finally gotten taken down. Like, whoa. I never thought this day would happen. And it's actually kind of wild that it is because Kiss Anime is like the powerhouse to watch anime. I mean... Even as much as Funimation and Crunchyroll tried, Kiss Anime was always the go-to site for everybody to watch anime, especially when we're all broke and a lot of people can't really be bothered to pay to watch anime. Let me not lie, yes, I've used Kiss Anime before and I used to watch a lot of anime and Kiss Anime, but as I've gotten older and I realized that Crunchyroll isn't really that expensive and most of the anime I watch is pretty much on Crunchyroll, I just decided to pay for that and I just watch all my anime on Crunchyroll now. So Kiss Anime and Kiss Manga. Oh, by the way, Kiss Manga got closed down, by the way. So um, yeah, Kiss Anime and Kiss Manga are like super big illegal streaming sites to watch anime and the problem we have with those is that they are so big that they make ridiculous amounts of money from anime. If you check right now, Kiss Anime was one of the biggest sites on the Alexa rank. That's how big Kiss Anime is. Like, I think it was like in the 200s or so, which is ridiculous. It has a higher rank than Crunchyroll and Funimation. So it's pretty understandable why the legal anime sites would want to crack down on the illegal one. It wasn't even them that went to crack down on Kiss Anime. Actually, it was the Japanese government. It turns out that the Japanese government is getting super strict at piracy laws. So they decided to come down at Kiss Anime, the big one, and said, all right, listen, y this can't run. You guys make millions of dollars of anime that's not yours you gotta close down and if you go on the anime kiss anime site you even see a message saying that the copyright has gotten us we won't be able to post anything again like it's it's, it's serious it's a big thing and like i said it's very understandable why kiss anime would be closed actually it's even surprising how kiss anime lasted this long let's be real here kiss anime makes ridiculous amount of money from the ads on kiss anime because so many people watch anime on kiss anime like if you saw the big shonen shows and the amount of views that kiss anime used to get also even the new shows if you see any new show on kiss anime and you saw the view count it hit millions like it hit millions so of course they were making bank so it's it's crazy that kiss anime is down because a lot of people are probably thinking oh my god where do i watch my anime guys let's be real it's come to that point let's pay for anime guys paying for anime it's not that hard like it's what eight dollars a month for crunchyroll and that's a mcdonald's meal that's a mcdonald's a month to get anime for a month all right i'll give you this right kiss anime was a blessing in disguise it was one of the reasons why i got into anime it gave me every anime i could possibly watch under the sun and it made me the anime nerd that i am today but you know good things have to come into an end and 2020 has taught us that a lot so yeah people can probably argue against me right now because the problem is what Kiss Anime had compared to the rest is that it had every anime on that site compared to segregated anime that we see in general anime legal sites. And that's the issue that we've been having because how can we pay for anime when the anime is so segregated? That's what people's problems were and that's why a lot of people just stick to using Kiss Anime. If the Sony deal goes with Crunchyroll, then this might be old news because they'll probably just buy all the anime and then all the anime will be on one place. So everybody will be glad to just watch everything all in one place on the other hand we could just have segregated anime for a while and that's just how it's gonna run but let's be real here everyone's just gonna jump on the next anime site that's big and illegal and has all your anime that's what's gonna happen and then that will get closed down and then the next one will come out and then that will get closed down and then the cycle just keeps on continuing really and truly you can't stop piracy it's just unfortunate it's the world we live in but i will say this to people right kiss anime used to make millions 
millions of dollars, right? And Crunchyroll and Funimation support the creators. Now, imagine if those millions that Kiss Anime had was going to the creators. We'd see a lot of season twos of those animes that we don't get. And also those creators will have more money compared to having the low income that they make in order to make anime in the first place. So yes, it's cool and it's nice to have anime that's free and all in one place. But what's also nice is supporting the creators that make the art form that we love so much so memorable. So just think about that for a minute. That's my thoughts on the whole situation. Are you happy that Kiss Anime is gone? Are you crying? Are you looking for the next new illegal anime site? Let me know in the comment section. I am open to discussion. Thank you very much for watching. Please like this video. Subscribe to my channel for more on pop culture. Also, don't forget to click the notification bell again. And also just like this video because you're awesome, man. And uh, stay safe, stay cool, and I'll see you later. All right, bye.